Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca and it has been a really long time since we last talked. Hopefully this video is not too long. I hope you all have been well. So if you guys are wondering why all of a sudden I'm back here on this channel after disappearing so long ago, it was unplanned. I'm pretty positive any disappearance on YouTube is unplanned. Um, it was one that I kind of needed to take with what had gone on. If you guys remember, back when I was making my videos, the last one that I posted definitely was not what I thought would be my last video. My dad ended up getting really sick and I'm not going to go into a lot of details because I don't want to break down on camera. Sometimes I do get emotional when I am explaining the story of what took place. Um, sometimes I don't and I just, I don't feel like it's a good thing to put a video out there on YouTube where I am bawling my eyes out. My dad ended up getting really sick and I took a break from YouTube with everything going on with him. October 5th, 2018, my dad passed away. Actually, interesting fact, January 14th would have been his 70th birthday if he was still alive. So, definitely, definitely did not see the direction my life was going. I'm very thankful that we don't know the future because I feel like it would add a lot of stress as things would get closer to something taking place. So I'm very thankful that I don't know the future, but I also have to state that I am angry at myself before losing my parent. If you've gone through loss of any kind, you kind of understand that specific loss based on the type of relationship you had with the person. But I can definitely state from losing a parent. I do not ever say to somebody, I completely understand how you're feeling now um, because I feel like that's a slap in the face because every single death, be it a, a quick death, a, a progression towards death, or, you know, somebody you had for a short amount of time or a, a long amount of time, it doesn't matter when it comes to losing a parent. It's such a crucial thing because this is somebody who has loved you unconditionally from before you were even born. And I won't say that I don't miss my dad. I miss him dreadfully. That I don't allow my grief to overwhelm me throughout the days. There are certain times such as his birthday or his death anniversary that it definitely hits harder. Or holidays is a, a big one that can sometimes get emotional with trying to create new traditions because he's not here anymore and the traditions that he was part of is one that we can't continue because well we can it's just really hard to continue those traditions specifically because you know that that person isn't there anymore so there there's why i i disappeared as as I will definitely state, not planned that that was going to be my last YouTube video. This channel definitely holds a really special part in my heart because I definitely was not 100% comfortable in front of the camera. I was like a very awkward YouTuber, booktuber, but I'll definitely state that here on my channel. Like, you guys can't see it, but if I was to put on a video, I could probably tell you what part of the video my dad popped his head in and was like, are you filming again? My dad and mom were huge supporters of my YouTube channel. From day one when I said, hey, I'm thinking of starting a, a channel and talking about books, they both were like, do it. I definitely have to say like their support was a huge, huge thing for me and I absolutely loved it and my dad loved watching my videos. After I would get them edited and posted, he'd be like, all right, bring it to me to watch. Now, not all of them did I have him watch. Like there's certain ones where I'm like, you're, you're just not going to be interested in that book. But every single video, like my parents were like so excited for me and so happy. Like they would get excited that I'd be you know, filming or, you know, helping me kind of create space. And I just, I love that. I love that they were so supportive about that because they knew from day one when I was 
first thinking about it to like it actually happening because there's so much of my dad in the background in all of the videos I just don't feel comfortable filming and posting on this channel anymore so because of that I've decided that this is going to be my last video for mad dog Rebecca <laughs> my my teenagehood showed up in that title Pirates of the Caribbean yep that was how that came about but uh for that reason I'm not going to be continuing on this channel with everything going on with COVID and a lot of uncertainty with the world and just having a lot more with staying at home I did work through the first wave of the pandemic I know everybody who worked through it or didn't everyone has a different experience with with COVID. For myself, I'm still working through the pandemic, even though there's, for here in Ontario, a second state of emergency that has been called with stay-at-home orders. I will still be working through this, but because of basically just going to work and coming home and staying home, I thought that perhaps getting back into YouTube might be a really fun thing to do, give me a little bit of an outlet, which is kind of why I initially got into YouTube was because I wanted to talk about books with other people or I wanted to share my thoughts. Well, I have decided to create a new channel and I will actually link that channel down below where you guys can go and take a peek and see if you're interested in continuing on watching video content from me, in which case you can go there and feel free to subscribe. I'm, I'm kind of excited to get back into making videos and talking to you guys, but as I said, I just don't feel comfortable doing it here on this channel. So that's kind of what I wanted to state. I'm excited to talk about books with you guys again. I still love reading. Have way too long of <laughs> a to read list. Way too many TBR books. But I definitely look forward to talking to you guys more. But if you guys would like to share what you've been up to, feel free to do so in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Hear about what's exciting and new in your life. I hope you're all staying safe and doing well during this pandemic. And... Yeah, if you want to follow over on that channel, I will, uh, I'll go from there with you guys. So I hope you have an awesome rest of the day and I will talk to you again over there or in the comments for this video. I think that's it. So if you guys have any questions, um, I will definitely answer those in the comments down below. And if you guys would like to stay friends and subscribe to that channel, I look forward to talking again. I hope you all stay safe, stay well, and I will talk to you again um, over on that other channel. All right, bye guys.